Now let's find out about another Delaware equine who was recently recognized in Arizona. This is Manolito Montoya. And this is Manolito Montoya. The Manolito Montoya who came first is this one. He was one of the main characters in the classic Western television show, The High Chaparral, which aired from September 1967 to March 1971. And this Manolito Montoya is a three-year-old pacer. He's had 12 starts this season at Dover Downs with three wins, two seconds and two thirds. The right at the top of the stretch, Manolito Montoya. The Warden down the inside, Jacks are better. Coming to the wire, Manolito Montoya is in front, 154 and three. The son of Western Terror is owned by Joanne King and trained by her husband, Jimmy. And Joanne named the standard bred Manolito Montoya because she is a huge fan of the high chaparral. And let's take this one step further. Now, the actor who played Manolito Montoya knows all about the horse Manolito Montoya because Joanne attended the recent High Chaparral reunion in Tucson, Arizona. She met the VIPs of the famous television western, including Henry Darrow, the actor who played, yep, you guessed it, Manolito Montoya on the series. In fact, Joanne took a Dover Downs win picture with her to the reunion and had Henry autograph the photo of his four-legged namesake. Manolito Montoya, the horse that is, has just started a few-month vacation now that the Dover Downs meet has concluded. So where will he be hanging his hat during his hiatus? Well, not exactly in Arizona. He'll be roaming the range on his local Harrington farm. But we'll see him back at Dover Downs later in the year for more rootin' tootin' visits to Victory Lane.